Hello everybody, welcome to my video. In this video I will show you how to play Cooking Up Something Good by Mank DeMarco. This one was requested by these two guys, thank you for your comment. Um, as you can see somebody requested the Combini version and uh, I will play all the versions together because the Combini version is almost the same as the studio version, only you have to put your capo on the 4th fret and tune your guitar to 432 hertz. When you want to play along with the studio version, just put your cape on the third fret, like I'm doing now. I will first show you the chords, so you can play along with the combini version and the normal version. So, And after I've done that, I will also tell you how to play the, the main melody, the... And also the, um, the, the melody, the riffs you hear, and the choruses, yeah. Thank you for watching so far, please like and subscribe and... If there's anything unclear, feel free to say so in the comments. So what I wanted to tell you about the chords and the dab is, uh, well first of all the chords, uh, in between chords he does that a lot also, uh, especially with the acoustic version, um, you sometimes just place the no strings and no chords at all between chords. That might sound a bit weird but I will show you what I mean. Really fast. Yeah so. That's what I wanted to tell about the chords. So sometimes you have to, you can choose by yourself when, but you have to, to sometimes just play no chord at all, just all the open chords. But you gotta do it fast because otherwise it will sound dissonant. And also the uh, the every A chord you have to slide it so like this. So you just place your your uh, index finger on the three notes and. Like Elvis Presley. Yeah. So. And also with the A chord, it's also okay to play the bottom 
E string. So you can also, or you can just play with it. It's really up to you. It's both an A chord. But it may be a bit difficult to place your finger like this and to keep the A string ringing. So that's why you can also mute it. Yeah, so that's what I want to tell you about the chords. Now I will show you how to play the riff. Um, when he does it live, he sometimes does it a little bit different than when he plays it. In the studio version, I will show you what I mean. This is the studio version. There's the studio version and this is the acoustic version. So you you may have seen what I meant by that. In the studio version he does the slide twice and in the acoustic version he a lot of lot of times he does it only uh, once. Um, and what I want to give you a tip about the uh, strumming pattern, it might be difficult sometimes, but what you gotta uh, do a lot, uh, and maybe you can do this already, but you gotta mute hit the string, so. So you do that by hitting the strums, and at the same time, palm mute it fully, so. That you get that sound, so. He does that a lot, so that's something that you might be useful. Um, so yeah, now I've shown you the, the type of the verses, I will also show you how to play the the, the, the melody of the, um, the chorus. So yeah, that's what I wanted to show you. Thank you so much for watching. Please like and subscribe. Check out my other Make the Marco stuff. I got a lots of songs of El Make the Marco's new album, and I hopefully will bring out uh, another new song of Make the Marco soon. Yeah, I hope to see you next time.